Ever wondered how to whip up the perfect crunchy caramel cookies and cream wafers right in your own kitchen? Today, we're going to unravel the secret step by step to achieving this delightful dessert that's sure to make your taste buds dance. First things first, gather your ingredients. For this recipe, you'll need two cups of all-purpose flour, one cup of granulated sugar, half a cup of unsweetened cocoa powder, a teaspoon of baking powder, a pinch of salt, two large eggs, half a cup of unsalted butter, a teaspoon of pure vanilla extract, one and a half cups of crushed cookies and cream candies, and a cup of caramel bits. Begin by preheating your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. While the oven is heating, grab a large bowl to mix your dry ingredients. Combine the flour, sugar, cocoa powder, baking powder, and salt. Stir until these ingredients are well mixed. Next, in a separate bowl, beat the eggs until they're light and frothy. Add the melted butter and vanilla extract to the eggs, stirring until they're well combined. Now it's time to combine the wet and dry ingredients. Pour the egg mixture into the dry ingredients, stirring until a dough forms. Here comes the fun part. Fold in the crushed cookies and cream candies and caramel bits into the dough. Make sure to distribute them evenly throughout the dough for a consistent taste in every bite. Once your dough is ready, shape it into small balls and place them on a greased baking sheet. Flatten each ball slightly with the back of a spoon to give your wafers their distinctive shape. Pop them into your preheated oven and bake for about 15 minutes, or until the edges are firm and the centers are still slightly soft. When they're done, remove your wafers from the oven and let them cool on the baking sheet for about 5 minutes. Then transfer them to a wire rack to cool completely. And voila! You've just created your own batch of mouth-watering crunchy caramel cookies and cream wafers. To summarize, this recipe involves gathering your ingredients, mixing your dry and wet ingredients separately, combining them to form a dough, folding in the candies and caramel bits, shaping and baking the wafers, and then allowing them to cool. Each step is simple and straightforward, yet each contributes to creating a dessert that's sure to impress. Remember, the key to a great dessert is not just the ingredients you use, but how you combine and cook them. With these crunchy caramel cookies and cream wafers, you have a dessert that's not just delicious, but also fun and easy to make. So why wait? Get out there and start baking!